If you heard your name being called in the woods and you didn't know who was doing it, would you go towards the, the sound? No, I'd burn the woods down. Howdy, folks. Welcome back to you, me, and the movies. And now, ooh. Werewolf in London. Do you know what this weekend is? Uh, ooh. You know what happens this weekend? 35th anniversary of Werewolf in London? No, it's a full moon this weekend. Oh, cool. You know what that means? Werewolves? We're watching a werewolf movie. What, a werewolf? A werewolf movie. A werewolf. For our Halloween season. Okay. And it's no other than The Howling from 1981. Uh, it's not going to be Teen Wolf? No, sorry. You have to wait another year or so for that. Dang. All right. But yeah. The Howling. This Sounds is scary. often compared to American Werewolf in London. For the practical effects and the creature effects. And they both came out around the same year. So. Oh, okay. Well, practical effects. I like practical effects. Yeah. So, this is fun. I remember watching this in high school. Well, I think I bought, like, three werewolf movies one night and just, like, binged. Binged. Had a werewolf, werewolf. marathon. <laughs> so, it's been since then since I've seen it. So, I, it's like a first-time watch for me tonight because I can't remember anything about that movie. Cool. So, this should be fun. Yeah. So, are you ready to get bit by a werewolf? Totally. Get your silver bullets ready? But first, like, comment, subscribe. Yeah, check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos, full commentary, access to polls, helps pick what we watch next. The link is down there. Check it out. I also have Twitter and Instagram, so if you like social media, you can follow us, or you don't have to. You don't have to. No. Let's watch The Howling. Here we go. You're not even wearing 3D glasses. <laughs> you believe in werewolves? I do. Don't you? Are werewolves actual things? Yeah, skin, skin like, changes. Oh, no, that's wolverines. That's wolverines. <laughs> wolverines. Yes, wolverines are an animal. I know. I was thinking werewolves, I was thinking werewolves were an actual animal for a second. I was like, wait. <laughs> Got myself a little confused. We should never try to deny the beast animal within us. I never do. <laughs> Always a bad sign. A smiley faces? Yeah, in your phone booth. Why? I don't know. Hmm. The KDHB news team began working with local police to link Eddie with a recent string of fate. Hi, Bill. That's a that's a brave little old girl you got there. His TV voice is very different, isn't it? Yeah. Stand by for news. Well, hold it, hold it. She's transmitting. Come on, Eddie. I know that's you. Yeah, yeah, I'm alone. Are you wearing what I ask you to? Oh, God. Are you wearing what I asked you to? Yeah, I am, actually. <laughs> you said, wear your Monster Vision shirt. Do you recognize her? She looks familiar, but I can't place her. It's Elliot's mom from E.T. Oh, yeah, okay. Oh, I could use a massage right now. <laughs> I don't think you want one from that neighborhood. Yeah, probably not. I'll give you one later, though. Oh, perfect. I guess, like, what is she doing in here? <laughs> She's looking for one of those power tools. Like a naked gun? Good one. Is it real people in, in there? Or is it, like, video? Oh, God. I knew you'd come, Karen. We have a lot to talk about. Video. Oh, God. What kind of vaccine you mean the movies? Yeah, those are private theaters. So people can whack off and then leave? Nobody ever did that. No, never. Except Pee Wee Herman. Just watch. I don't want to watch this. She didn't feel a thing, Karen. None of them do. One of those his private films, then? I don't know. It's really fucking creepy. Oh, God. 
the fuck kind of movie is this? Yeah, there's a broad that came in here. She emptied the place out. She's watching movies. What the fuck is this? Whatever happened in your own words, nothing newsy. I don't know what happened in there. I don't, I don't remember. Oh, she's in shock. At least they got the guy, right? I guess. I... Jeez. Kid had talent. Hmm. Wonder if this is a real place. It's a pretty good artist. No, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. She's a little traumatized. Mm-hmm. Good luck. Boy, she seems shaky. Look fine to me. <laughs> For a violence. Who knows? Maybe she's pregnant. Oh, to... Listen, get in touch with that Fujiyama Fujimoto. I mean, who knows? Maybe she is. <laughs> who knows? Maybe she's on her period. You know, but all I remember is pushing open the door, and then I'm outside, and the police are there, and Bill's there, and the remote crew, and it's over. It's all we remember, too. <laughs> I'm going to recommend that you go out to the colony for a week or two. Your place up north there? That's right. Now, I only recommend it to very special patients, ones who I think will benefit from its environment. She needs a sabbatical vacation. A little vacation, hmm. Is this like a vacation at a funny farm, though? Is it? No, I don't know. Well, I hope these people aren't too weird. Totally normal. Karen, why? Uh, oh my god. We watch you on the news all the time. Uh, You're our second favorite. Right behind... Uh, what's the name of that Oriental girl, Jer? <laughs> He's like, oh god, she's embarrassing. <laughs> I think I'm gonna borrow Karen and just give her the rundown on the colony. <laughs> uh, don't leave out the juicy stuff. Oh, I won't. What's the juicy stuff? <laughs> A doctor sent her to her sex cult. Right? Well, they're all clothed, so... Right now. Mm, he looks like he's chewing on some shit. Damn one like this. Damn teeth are shot. Hell of a note. Huh. Why did they... What's in it? She roofied that. Looking for my wife. Why? Yeah, anywho, <laughs> <laughs> God, she creeped him out. How's your bungalow? Oh, it's quite nice. Thing. We're Good. neighbors. Oh, you are. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All these people are creeping them out. Oh, gross. What is with these dudes? You've done enough damage already. What the fuck? What is going on? Do you know what's going on? I can't remember what this movie's about now. She's an infomaniac. No. It's just that it's so uh, unchallenged. She has a long way to go. Before she's a nymphomaniac. <laughs> He's a werewolf. He is? Yeah. Don't even think about it. I want to end it. 
It just goes on and on. Oh, well, you know better than that. How many of these people are werewolves? All of them? We always have to something out there. Outside, something was howling. Sound like multiple owls to me. I'm telling you. Most of them are probably werewolves. It's like a werewolf recruiting camp. That was a cat, right? I don't know what that was. If you're freaked out by something outside, don't go outside. How dumb. Well, she's got a flashlight. Yeah, it makes you safe. If you're freaked out by something outside, you just said your wife. Yep. Honey, there's something outside. <laughs> like all those cows. <laughs> I went outside. I just came to get you because I didn't know what the hell to do. A hundred cows in our front yard. <laughs> Figured you'd know who to call. There were our cows. Ghostbusters. So that guy was in their bushes. Creeper. Oh, that you folks had a coyote problem out here. Hey, you're famous, ain't you? Sort of. Sam. His shirt is like busting at the buttons, isn't it? Don't get many of you uh, TV people in here. Mostly it's your newspaper guys like to come in, look at the meat. I don't know how you can stand it. Yeah, it doesn't bother me. <laughs> Brains next to his cheeseburger. He? he was here this morning. God, look at the door. Oh, jeez. I don't suppose somebody could have stolen him, do you? Wasn't dead. He didn't get up and walk out on his own. Just knocked out? I don't know, how does that work? Maybe he did get up and walk out on his own. There are cows around here? Charlie Barton's got a couple of acres of pasture just down the hill. They don't sound right. <laughs> I'm not really sure how cows are supposed to sound. Not like that. Yeah, <laughs> not quite like that. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Right. There's your cow. That's oh, a bull. Ah! What's that gun? God! Man? Sorry to scare you, ma'am. Thought you was a cowjacker. <laughs> you know what did it? Well, it ain't a coyote. That's a scene. It's a pack of coyotes. Wolves. Wolves, maybe. Hey, don't you guys usually use a dog in this kind of hunt? Usually. Well, these clowns shoot all of them. Besides, who needs dogs? We got TC. I still think it was UFOs. Them cattle mutilations. Good, Earl, good. Somebody reads the National Enquirer. Hey, I got it. First shot. Well, the cows are safe now. <laughs> A number of young women were killed in the next month, their bodies exhibiting signs of animal attack. What's that? Warlocks, werewolves, and demons. Definitely wasn't a warlock. We'll find out if any of Eddie's killings were on a full moon. Hey, that's a lot of Hollywood baloney. Your classic werewolf could change shape any time it wants, day and night. That's why I call them shapeshifters. I got a dozen books on it. What about killing it with silver bullets? Well, sure. Silver bullets are fire. It's the only way to get rid of the damn things. They come back from the dead if you don't kill them right. Cut off an arm, cut off a leg, stick a knife in a heart, nothing. They may look dead, but bam, three days later, they're as good as new. Silver bullets. Some joker ordered them. 30 06. Never picked them up. I take Bank America, American Express, Visa. You gonna buy that or what? Uh, yeah, these two. Get the silver bullets, too. That's a good book. Little Red Riding Hood. You kill something you don't eat, now that's a sin. Yeah, well, I never thought of it like that. The place just over there. My sister would be glad to cook it up for you. She's definitely turning people into werewolves, right? She is? Yeah. I'll cook it later. So do you think a werewolf can really change anytime it wants? Yeah, probably. Shapeshifter. 
if they are the way that that guy has read them, I don't know enough about werewolf lore. That didn't look like a wolf, it looked like a creepy something. He's a werewolf now. Give it a few days. Probably just rabies. I want to go home. I wouldn't advise traveling right now. Bye. This guy's turning people into werewolves. You think he knows? Yeah, it's got to be like some sort of fucking weird experiment. Between a wolf and a man? You're kidding me. No, listen, we'll come right up, okay? Bill just got bitten by a wolf. Oh, yeah, but he's bitten by a werewolf and lives, becomes a werewolf himself. Come on, Terry, it's only a... Did they get the silver bullets? I don't think they did. Donna calls her Marsha the Maneater. <laughs> really? And, and you think she's trying to make the move on Bill? Oh, I don't know. It's just a feeling. I sound paranoid, don't I? No, trust those feelings. Totally forgot huh? about Bill in this dinner. Bill, Bill, I, I'm really sorry. I told He's you. eating meat. I get hungry enough. I'll eat anything. It's weird that guy work owns a gym. Mm -hmm. Wouldn't eat meat. It's weird. A health fanatic in the 80s? That yeah. seems like fitting, I guess. Oh, shit. Oh, God. Karen is not going to be happy about this. I'll come back to you mean the boobies, and you mean the bush. Probably just a Merkin. Nah, it's the 80s. Yeah, it's legit bush. Is she a she-wolf? A, a were-wolf? She? She? Sure. A sure-wolf? What? A sure-wolf? A, sh a sure-wolf? <laughs> I think they're all just werewolves. Huh. It's not like merman and mermaid. Why is this doctor turning everyone into a werewolf? It's creepy. It's the howling. Ugh. They're really going at it. Just licking it. There they are. Oh, yeah. Just surprised they're not doing it doggy style. <laughs> Good one. Ew. Hmm. That's the photo. I mean, the picture that the kid drew. The painting? Yeah. Or the drawing, yeah. You didn't recognize that the first time they were there? No. She's like, man, why does this look so familiar? <laughs> Took her longer to realize that than you. Weird. Uh-oh. I'd watch out behind you. If you heard your name being called in the woods and you didn't know who was doing it, would you go towards the, the sound? No, I'd burn the woods down. Yeah, I would, like, be out of there so freaking fast. Also, how does the werewolf know her name? Maybe it's somebody she knows. Whose house is this? Which Witch's brother? Or the she-wolf's brother? Foot back there. Oh, 
Oh, maybe it's just the she-wolf's cabin. Is this guy a crazy psycho killer who was also a werewolf? And he's like, not supposed to be a crazy... Oh, I just gotta stop. It's a creepy brother, huh? It's Eddie's cabin. Right. Who is that? The creepy brother, probably. Throw yourself out that window, honey. Oh, it's too late. She's turn gonna turn too. Oh, it'll regenerate though. Ew. Gross. Severed limbs disintegrate. Looks like it. Or not. Turning back into a human hand. Is it growing another man? Do you think she's a werewolf now that she got scratched? Yeah. Wasn't Karen scratched though? Or just bruised? She was just bruised. I don't know. You've been with her, haven't you? That why she well, Don't lay your fantasies out on me. Oh, please. I'm not going to take that I one. I know. Anymore. It's all a big conspiracy as far as. You know, you don't have one in your backbone. Little she Karen. Walks by you like a bitch in here. For leaving? Yeah. And not yeah. wanting to know. Yeah. Where are you? At Doc's? Yeah. Christopher, I'll tell you something. I think he's got to be a part of this. Get the fuck out of there. Quist Marsha. Quist TC. Oh, Christ. It's Eddie. Quist. Oh. Eddie, TC, and Marsha, brother siblings. I want to stay behind that light. I'll get a hold of the state boys, and we'll meet you over. Wolf the chili. <laughs> I'm sure she's safe. She's not safe. She's gonna die. Oh no. I liked her. Yeah. All Karen's friends are gonna be werewolves? I guess so. Is she gonna be a werewolf? She's dead. I think she's dead. Well, those are real silver. I gotta check in with a jeweler to find out what the charge. Bill me. Well, he went back and got the bullets. Good choice. She's handling this much better than I would have expected. Oh, she is a werewolf. Oh, no. What a dick. Playing games. I'm glad you came. I wanted to see you again. He looks rough. You know, the copper shot him right in the head. Look at me. You look good. You look great. What are you doing? Uh, what are you doing? Uh, ew, 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 ew. Uh, what the f- Ugh. Why did he do that? Did he take a bullet out of his head? How did they make it do that? Like an animatronic side, do you think? Oh, there it goes. How 
do they do this practically? You got some shit in your mouth, dude. Again, handling herself remarkably well. Does that count as burning if it's acid? I don't think so. Come on, take come it easy, on. pal. You know, uh, not all of us have got enough money for a Mazda. Some of us have to work for a living, you know what I mean? <laughs> it's a nice little RX-7, though. I think it was an RX-7. Come on out of there now, miss. We've been waiting for you. They finally caught the freaking, cow mutilator. Freaking funny farm. She looks rough. It's a really weird cult. I appreciate they're all going to look a little rough. <laughs> rough. <laughs> oh, he's the leader of this pack. I don't think he has enough bullets for all of them. Maybe you one shot one kills them all. When I was first bitten, I fought against it. And so did Jerry. And then we found the doctor. He helped us. You see, Karen, he understands all about the gift. He knows how to use it. What a cult. We can fit in, you said. We can live with them. I don't think any of her family fit in. No. Is that a Miata? She can't disappear. She's well known. He's right, Marsha. <laughs> you can't tame what's meant to be a wild dog. It ain't natural. <laughs> Eddie's victims were bitten, almost as if they had been attacked by an animal. Doctor, what can you do? Okay, taste it. <laughs> We've been jammed. No. <laughs> Just kidding. Hello, bright boy. Who the fuck are you? Eddie? Eddie just took the acid to the face. Oh, yeah. She's got a sexy voice. I like a woman with a sexy voice. Ugh. Here. Take it. He doesn't know it's loaded with silver bullets. Don't you know anything? <laughs> Shoot him now. Well, don't waste all of them. Oh, Eddie's dead. Oh, well, there's two quests down. He wanted it to be over. Doesn't have enough bullets for all of these folks. Here, get the door. You're gonna burn him? How about a little fire, Scarecrow? Burn faster. Didn't see her husband in there. There he is. Shoot it. I get him. Oh, stop. It's Sam. Oh, don't stop. Kaboom! Yeah. They had to recall those Mazdas because took three bullets and blew up. The fuck? 
they all got out? He's just flooding the engine. Better save one of those bullets for yourself. We have to warn people, Chris. We have to make them believe. Don't go to the colony if you don't want to become a werewolf. Not sure I can go through with this. You have to. Seeing a killer on screen. How's she look? She look all right to you? Reports so far indicate that bodies have been. She's gonna turn on on camera. Tonight I'm gonna sh show you something. Make you believe. <laughs> What is this? <laughs> what are you kids watching? The newsletter's turned into a werewolf. <laughs> oh boy. That bookstore guy's business is about to skyrocket. Yeah. Switch! Switch, damn it! Switch! Mm -hmm. Doesn't that look good? Delicious. Things I do with special effects these days. <laughs> it was real. She turned into a werewolf and they shot her. You're plastic. Doesn't mean it wasn't real. <laughs> Hamburger for the lady. How do you want that? How do you want it, honey? Oh, God. Rare. Well, that was different. Do you want to watch this barbecue continue to cook? No, thanks. All right. Oh, boy. The Howling. Yeah. What do you think? It's creepy. Yeah. It's like a cult movie meets a werewolf movie. Yeah. Yeah. Pretty good special effects. Practical, yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Early 80s. Yeah, pretty good. Pretty good transformation scenes there. Mm -hmm. How would you compare that to the other transformation scene you've seen with uh, American Werewolf? In London. I think American Wolf in London, the transition scene was maybe a little bit cooler. Yeah. Yeah. I think it looked better. This was good because, like, you could, like, see the face kind of, like, tw twitching yeah. and moving and twitching and moving. But that, they also stayed on the face so much that yeah. it just didn't make it as impactful as yeah. the American Wolf. Yeah, London. the American Werewolf was more... It was his whole body. It was quicker, and it they didn't... You know, stretch out the scene too long. And yeah. It was like the different body parts, and it was done. Right. Yeah. What I like about this though is you see multiple werewolves, mm -hmm. and I think the full-bodied werewolf practical mm -hmm. effect was a lot better than American Werewolf in London. the The full-bodied werewolf in American Werewolf in London was pretty fake looking. The only thing that I really didn't love about this transformation for the werewolf is the hands. Yeah, you didn't like the nails growing out. The nails growing out was cool, but their fingers were really long. Like yeah. wolves don't have really long fingers. Werewolves do. It's just weird. That was just a little bit of an it's odd. Like the claws were pretty, pretty good. I liked it. American Werewolf in London's better because it they were more like paws, you know. Yeah. Also, the sex out. scene in this wasn't realistic at all. Werewolves no, they, do a doggy style. Yeah, absolutely. They were doing a doggy style. Actually, this is a franchise, too. There's multiple sequels to The Howling. Oh, really? Yeah. Great. I'm not sure. I think it might be like we four. We don't have to watch them, though. Movies. Yeah, we're watching them all the rest of the month. Lovely. I'm just kidding. We're just watching this one. I was trying to remember who uh, Terry looked familiar, too. Karen was E.T. Elliot's wife, mm -hmm. or mom, but her friend Terry, I couldn't make out where I've seen her before, but she looks familiar. The Mazda guy, he's familiar too. Yeah. Also, the her boss at the TV station. Mm -hmm. I'm pretty sure it was the TV station boss in UHF. UHF? Yeah, the bad guy. Oh, could be. Could be. So. He did look very familiar. I was like, yeah. I recognize him from something. So he's always running a TV station or something in his movies, apparently. Yeah, must be. Well, what else is on your mind about this movie? I'm just wondering what everyone else was thinking about the 
comparison between American Werewolf in London and The Howling. Like, yeah. what do you like better and why? Yeah, do you also like the rules of this movie where werewolves can uh, shape shift shape shift whenever they want and not just on a full moon? To me, they're different things. Like a shape shifter and a yeah. werewolf are different, but I again, like I get my werewolf knowledge from like freaking Twilight. Yeah, I was almost gonna say I think the cove looks similar to, to the cliff they jump off. In I don't Twilight. think it is, but it's, it could be an homage similar. to the Howling. Could be that they jumped off that same cliff, so. I don't know that... You have to watch the, the movies again, huh? Yep, yeah, definitely. Ugh. No thanks. <laughs> well, what should people comment on? I just uh, asked them. Yeah. Uh, what do you think of this movie's special effects? Yeah. And where does it line up in your werewolf rankings? Absolutely. And it's compared compare it to American Werewolf in London, because they came out about the same time. Same yep. kind of stuff. And uh, yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for hanging out. Come back next week. Yeah, check out our Patreon link down below for early access to our videos, full length commentary, access to polls, so pick what we watch next. Links down there, check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.